If you are watching this video, I'm going to assume that you are like on the brink of wanting to quit your job, wanting to have the ultimate freedom because we are living in a world today where you see people making money, doing literally anything and you're like, what is this world and why am I still working my nine to five when I could be doing XYZ for this amount of money. And I'm here to tell you that there is a reason why you want ultimate freedom based on your natural alignment. So astrologically speaking, I'm going to be talking on some points and some, you know, positions that I've seen within a birth chart that would make somebody just want to just quit and become an entrepreneur, you know, be a little bit more creative in what they do for a living. And um, as somebody who quit a very secured job with a salary, with a retirement plan, and was just like, I can't do this anymore. I know why now, based on my birth chart. <laughs> but there are some of you who uh, will naturally have this inclination that, you know, what you're doing is not fulfilling you anymore. And you feel like you're on this like hamster wheel where you want to escape especially like I said every time you open up social media or something you will see someone living the life or what you think is living the life um and I'm not you know to say that everyone who quits you know is going to live this expensive extensive lifestyle but it's more of like time will be given back to you freedom would be given back to you and just the feeling of not having to answer to somebody or feel like I need to ask for permission to eat a permission to go to the bathroom like all of that is insane to me and especially if you have the energy inside of you were like you're like I can just create anything I can make anything I can invent something like I know I have the potential to do something that is just not clocking in clocking out and feeling like again you're spinning around doing the same exact thing every single day some of you who were born on the 12th. Um, there are some particular birthdays that are born on the 12th where they will feel like I will need to leave a secure job because I need the freedom. Because 12, you add one and two together, that's three. And three is Jupiter energy. And Jupiter is all about freedom, expansion, new opportunities. And so people who are born with that energy of needing to be free all the time to roam around all the time of course a nine to five is not going to work because you are confined in an area you know you have to be um somebody who has to ask for permission for things permission for vacation like not gonna work when I was teaching <laughs> I'm not asking for permission I'm just doing it I'm just putting it into the system and that's it like there's no we shouldn't have to ask for permission to do anything. Now, I understand when you're running a company, you know, people can't just take off whenever they want to or whatever. But like I said, if you have that in you to want to be free, again, a nine to five is not going to work for you. And you're you're feeling the need right now probably to quit. Um, and I'm not saying everyone who quits will be this millionaire, but you have the potential because you have been given that time back some of you um i would say that some people are really good at becoming entrepreneurs if they just had that validity like i said within your chart within your birth chart the more that you learn the more that you study you will see that i have these gifts and i've thought about them i knew something was up but now this solidifies like yes i do have the potential some people have the potential to have great ideas but they're not an executor, so they would need a business partner or something. And so, again, that's where your birth chart will tell you the energy of how your life can go based on your specific alignment. So I am now a little over a year since I quit my job and um, still in my same apartment. <laughs> so, um, But the risk that I took leaving something that was secure... For something that gave me the ultimate freedom, like y'all, I think too, because of the security that is within a job, people feel like, well, I can't leave because I have bills. I have this, I have that. But I am somebody who's highly optimistic. 
Um, but I also believe that God doesn't put things inside of you, those feelings, those, you know, need for things just to be having them just to play with you, just to, you know, mess around and being like, psych, I know you want to be free, but you're going to have to stay at this place forever. Like, no, you have that feeling for a reason. And so taking that leap is saying like, okay, I trust in your way and how this is supposed to go. Cause you wouldn't just do something just to do it. There's a reason why you're doing every single thing. You just sometimes need the validation. Like, okay, I am going in the right direction again, based on my own birth chart, based on my alignment, because I did, I did a reading with somebody who was born on the 12th, who is, you know, a very successful, um, lawyer, um, but wants to, again, pursue their own thing. And the reason why they became a lawyer was because of somebody else's, you know, dreams and wishes, but they really want to do their own thing. And they attempted it before and then jumped right back into the secure job because again, they didn't have that validation. So, okay. I'm giving you the validation. Like there's a reason why you feel like that. It is difficult, especially in this economy. Um, but I don't like to say that everyone is not thriving because there are people who are thriving on the other side of the world around the corner from you, because the earth has to balance itself out. The universe has to balance itself out. So for everyone that's not doing so well, there's somebody who's doing really well. So don't go into this um, you know, and have this idea that, well, everyone's down bad. Everybody's struggling. No, <laughs> they're not. Every time I go get my coffee, there's like 50 other people who are just in there spending their entire day. there, not going to a quote job. Don't know what they're doing. But like I said, there's people around here like thriving. So don't let social media tell you that, you know, you don't have potential because the economy is so bad. No, I don't believe that. Um, but I will say, if you do have that, I keep saying energy, but that feeling in you that you really want to be free, then maybe this is your sign to quit that job. There are so many different ways that you can make money today online, social media, of course, going viral content creation. That's just something that's there. But you got DoorDash, you got Uber, you got, I mean, everything, you got all the tools there to, you know, pick how much you want to work now it's also depending on what kind of lifestyle do you want to have or do you just want to have freedom you know there's upwork there's um this app called d scout there's just so much you can do to make money um i think just people don't really believe in themselves or don't want to actually work at all they just don't want to work um and that's the thing too like just do what you got to do to survive and eat but I'm telling you, getting your time back has been like my sleep is so much better. My mental state is so much better. And I just really wish that everybody who does have this dream to want to um, live on their own, that they go and pursue it. Um, you know, some people say, well, then keep the nine to five to, to fund, you know, what you're doing. Yes and no, because again, you're still having to give your time to the other job. When if you got those eight hours back, how quickly could you speed up the process to whatever it is that you want to do? So that's kind of what I tell, you know, my clients when I talk to people about this kind of stuff that, yes, I understand that part. But at the same time, if you were to be given an extra eight hours, what would you do with those eight hours? You would find a way. And I'm telling you, when you know that something is not secure or, you know, coming in that's secure every two weeks, that lights a fire in you even more like you that hustle. When I'm telling you the hustle comes out the creativity comes out, you become more creative, because of course, you're getting more time back. Um, but why not? So again, I'm not telling everybody, hey, everyone quit, quit your job, because you have to be aware, you know, what you're working with and what you're willing to sacrifice. If you're willing to sacrifice, um, you know, seeing if you're even going to be able to pay rent the next month, then you do that. But that's up to you, you know, you better than anyone else. Okay, so Anyways, y'all, just wanted to get on here and say that um, because, again, I've gotten a couple of career readings where people just want to quit and they want to just be entrepreneurs, but they kind of don't know or, you know, feel like if they're going to be successful. That is up to you. That's your mindset. If you don't think you are and you want to stay scared, then you can continue to go to your job and clock in, clock out and ask for permission to leave and all of that. Or you can take the risk. And look online, because I'm telling you, creativity is the ticket out. 
Creativity is the ticket out. That's why they kill creativity in schools. HISD, Houston Independent School District has killed creativity. My friends work for the district and kids aren't even allowed to color, like no coloring, no music, no art on the walls. Like it's very much Miss Trunchbold from Matilda when she comes into the classroom and, and everything turns boring. That's Houston Independent School District now. So when you kill creativity, you kill logic and intelligence because that's another level of intelligence. And you just kill that when you're having kids just write and do math and very boring stuff. But anyways, that's going on a whole nother tangent, y'all. But if you're somebody, again, who is feeling like I want to quit, but I don't know what to do, whatever, and you want a career, career consultation with me, I can look at your birth chart. I can go through several different charts of everything that I've learned. Um, and then just kind of guide you and tell you based on your alignment, what you are capable of. So go ahead and hit me up on any social media platform, visit my website. Let's talk, let's chat y'all, because I want everyone to be free. I want everybody to be free. Thank y'all. And I will talk to y'all soon.